All right, in this video, I wanna show you one of my favorite games to use with the Flight Scope Skills app and the Mevo Plus. Let's get to it. Scott Ogan coming at you. We are here in the Studio 2.0. We are locked indoors. But does that mean we can't get better at golf? Of course not. Technology's so good nowadays. We've got things like the Mevo Plus and cameras, all that stuff you can get better with. So of course we're gonna get better at golf while we are in quarantine. So today I'm gonna to show you what I've done with my Epic programs and students all throughout the country with how we used to evaluate players and have them know if they're getting better. And that was with the Flight Scope Skills app. And we're gonna play one of my favorite games today. Before we do that, if you are getting a home setup, getting some of the equipment you need, make sure you check out Top Shelf Golf. There's a link down below to do so where you can get everything you need for your home golf simulator setup. That's where I go. So make sure you check them out and click that link below to get what you need. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's get into what we do in the wedge range. That's what we're gonna work on. 50 to 100 yards, something that I got when I visited Mike Bender's Academy many years ago and said, hey, that's something I need to borrow with my players. So we took it home, we were inside in a very small room just like this and we got better doing this particular game. So let's go check it out. All right, so we have the wedge range here on the Flight Scope Skills app. So if you're not familiar with what the Skills app is, it comes with the Flight Scope Mevo Plus. It's something I used with the Flight Scope X2 when I had that. I love this. This was a staple and still is of what my teaching and coaching is. We always have to kind of know where we're at with particular skills. So we like to have tests that break those down. That comes a little bit from other teachers like Mike Vender when this particular wedge range being so important, I believe, in the game of golf, being able to hit wedges. So we built this test. What it is, 50 to 100 yards. You got 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 100. And you've got five balls at each target with each ring representing a point total. If you hit the bullseye, that is worth five points. If you hit the ring closest to the bullseye, that is three points. You get a one point bonus for the bullseye. Two points for the second to the outer ring, and then the outer ring is one. Obviously zero points if you miss. Love doing this, great challenge to see how many points you can get. And then also it will tell you proximities when you're starting to hit these shots. The distances on the rings, actually Flight Scope comes up with those and gives you a really good number, I think, to go for, especially if you're at a kind of intermediate to moving into an advanced level. I think you're, you're good to go there. So let's go ahead. Let's move in. Let's hit a shot with this and let's go through and play a game. There's my 50, first 50 off the board. All right, two points, right on line, just a little short. You used to focus a lot on that. And then you can work on a variety of things, you know, what you, what you need to work on. Ooh, I chunked that a touch, so yeah, it's gonna be a little short. All right, so that's that 50 to 100 yard wedge range. What I love is we can start looking at it. What we would do is say, all right, hey, 50 to 75, pretty good. If I'm gonna be playing, I gotta get that up a little bit more, but you can see definitely the 100 yards I struggled with. That was mainly because I hit one shot off the grid. You just can't do that in this test. So um, that hurts me. Scored a 111 out of 150, not too shabby for the first go. I think my high in this is like 143 or something like that, 142. So that would be interesting to hear for those of you that do it, what do you score on this test? So that's the wedge range, great one. If you're working on short shots, especially if you got limited room in your setup, can't hit the full drivers and stuff. I mean, getting to master this part of the game is great. Learning what your club is and what your swing size is for each shot, you can't beat it. It's gonna be so huge for your game. So we will have more of these challenges and what I use and how I do it. Some of it's gonna involve just using the straight up Flight Scope Skills app. We might have some barriers in the way that you see, but 
If you want more of these, make sure you click that subscribe button down below. Don't miss out on them. And we look forward to helping you in this quarantine time get better at your game. So if you have any questions, please post comments below. Stay healthy. Stay safe, everybody out there. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.